Hi, welcome. This is a set of videos where I'll be solving elementary problems of quantum mechanics. This content is intended for those who are studying undergrad and taking an introductory course in quantum mechanics. Please subscribe to my channel and leave a like if this content has helped you somehow. To get started, let's consider the following quantum state. Cat Psi 1 equal to 3 Cat plus plus 4 Cat minus. When it comes to quantum mechanics, the first thing we want to do is to normalize our quantum state. The reason for that is simple. Usually, what comes after is finding probabilities. Then, our quantum state must be normalized. Otherwise, we'll end up with a probability higher than 1. To normalize this quantum state, my first step will be introduce a normalization constant. It will be cat psi 1 equal to c uh, 3 cat plus plus 4 cat minus and then we have to calculate the inner product of cat psi 1 with itself and set it equal to 1. Here we have a new object that's called bra and here we have the cat. So put in simple words bra is defined by the complex conjugated of the cat. Then it brings us to this representation. A bra psi 1 will be c star uh, 3 bra plus plus 4 bra minus. So once we have here these two objects, our cat and the bra, we're ready to calculate the inner product. So let's do that then. So here we have c c star that multiplies uh, 3 bra plus plus 4 bra minus that multiplies um, 3 cat plus plus 4 cat minus and it must be equal to 1 in order to define our normalization constant. Through the complex numbers we know that a complex number multiplied by its complex conjugated, it gives us the complex number squared. Then here we have to do the simple math and multiply term by term. And uh, yeah, so we have the first term will be 9 bra plus cat plus plus uh, 12 bra plus cat minus plus 12 cat minus sorry bra minus cat plus plus 16 bra minus cat minus it should be equal to 1 here we can explore one important condition uh, that is the orth orthogonality condition so as cat plus and cat minus form a basis, we know that they are orthonormal and then this term here should be zero, this term here should be zero, and uh, these two terms here is equal to one. Essentially here we have the inner product of let's say a vector with itself. As it is a unit vector and if we take the inner product between this vector with itself it gives us uh, the unit which is it's equal to 1. So then we can conclude that our C 
squared we have 9 plus 20 sorry so 9 plus 16 equal to 1 which gives us c equal to 1 over 5 then we have our first quantum state normalized cat psi 1 equal to 3 over 5 cat plus plus 4 over 5 cat minus so this is our first quantum state normalized now let's take our second quantum state represented by the cat psi 2 being um, cat plus plus 2i cat minus as we did before the first step we have to take here is, is to introduce the normalization constant represented by the letter c and cat plus plus 2i cat minus then if you take the complex conjugated of this expression we get the bra psi 2 which is c star uh, bra plus minus 2i bra minus not that now the sign here um, was changed just because we have a complex number involved and uh, we have to calculate the inner product of cat psi 2 with itself and set it equal to 1 as we did before so basically c c star uh, bra plus minus 2 i bra minus that multiplies uh, cat plus plus 2i uh, cat minus it must be 1 so here we have for the same reasons discussed before we have c squared I will skip some steps here and go direct to the point if we multiply this first term here we have 1 this term multiplied by the second one here is zero because cat plus and cat minus are orthogonal then if we multiply this term by this is also zero and this second term by the second term here gives us uh, minus 2i 2i uh, I have here plus right and uh, it should be must be equal to one so not that <coughs> so i consider the here bra minus and the cat minus equal to one so then we have c equal to c squared um sorry here so c squared uh, here we have 1 uh, plus 4 equal to 1 which gives us c equal to 1 over the square root of 5 then our normalized quantum state cat psi 2 is equal to uh, 1 over square root of 5 uh, bra plus plus 2i sorry here is cat plus uh, cat minus so here is our second quantum state normalized and finally let's suppose we have a quantum state given by the cat psi 3 being uh, 3 cat plus minus exponential i pi over 3 it seems to be complicated but it's actually not so then let's follow the same steps introducing here one normalization constant 3 minus exponential i pi over 
over 3, cat minus, and then if you take the complex conjugated of this cat psi 3, we get the bra psi 3, C star, uh, 3 bra plus, minus exponential, minus i pi over 3, uh, bra minus. So not here also the sign changed here on the argument of our exponential and uh, we need to calculate the inner product the same thing as we did before and if we calculate that we have let's keep some step some steps and go directly here we have c c star and uh, if we multiply here uh, this uh, term by this term we get 9 plus 1 equal to 1 it gives us c equal to 1 over the square root of 10, 10. Um, then our last normalized quantum state is given by 1 over the square root of 10 um, 3 cat plus minus exponential i pi over 3 cat minus so this is our last quantum state normalized this is what you gotta do to normalize a quantum state through bracket notation thanks for watching See you next time.